Hello and welcome back. Today uh, I'm going to do a bit of a journey into the nether. Uh, I have been in there but I don't really know much about it. And a little bit of a farm with cows and a little bit of wheat so I can breed them. Got a lot of steak. Got this diamond pickaxe was from Benny. Thank you for that. And the diamond sword I got. Oh, another cow. Come here. <laughs> oh, man. But uh, I got Louis 3. I'm breaking 3. And when you want, as you can see. And I also got a gift from TJ. Very thank you about that for the for the Riptide 3 and the book shows in the Lapis. And I've done a little bit of off cam mining by going to the Stone Peaks uh, using the Elytra. And I got like, what was it like? Yeah, this amount of iron I got just with one hour's worth of uh, mine. And I have to make some new set of armor because I uh, this one is about to die. And I'm going to be making the armor so I can go to the, the nether fortress because I actually want to get uh, some witcher skulls and some blaze rods. Maybe even some nether work. Uh, it'll be pretty worth it because I actually need it need a beacon because uh since i have enough for a beacon but it's not gonna like i just really need a beacon because i kind of want to mine some area out like maybe even below so that we can have a super smelter it's nice to have an early game because honestly it's a little hard to keep going on there and stuff but um yeah and since uh actually it would be nice if I had someone to help me because I know I'm going to die now because I, uh, last episode, like, I think you haven't seen, but, uh, not like about, like, uh, what was it? Maybe 10 times? <laughs> yeah, a little awkward. And honestly, I just don't want to keep dying. And also, I grab a lot of slabs so I can, like, block off areas in the nether fortress because I don't want the stupid weather skeleton catching up to me. So yeah, uh, this is going to be scary. I might regret get this, but I really want some help. Actually, let's go. Oh, let's go to spawn now and go into another portal. See you there. So I'm at spawn. I actually got uh, five tomes from uh, Ashley because like there's a totem farm and I have an extra shield just for like like forever who wants to come and help me. And I have to go to spawn because this is the only area that has an actual nether portal. And yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Come on. Yep. I have a squirt to settle with a stupid weather skeleton. Where is the nether portal? I know there was a nether portal here somewhere. Right, over here. Oh, you have a shield. Oh, yeah. Shield. Okay, now, where's the way to the main fortress? This is there. Let's see who's on. Uh oh. Uh oh. You know, I'm very much prepared. I'm still scared. And I know I'm going to die a lot. Um, now, I know there was a path to another fortress somewhere. Oh, oh. This is why I have a total mine. Oh boy. Oh, oh no. No, 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 no. Oh no. Let's block this off, okay? Okay. Uh, let's block it off again. Just in case, because I know skinnies are here. Oh! Oh, this is what I talking about. Yep, he just withered away too. Or killed by enemies with a skeleton. Yep, I have a squad to settle now. Actually, settle with a stupid wither skeleton. Stained skeletons. And we're back. 
I uh, just had to encounter with stupid blazes and... Oh boy. And thank you, Ashley. Oh boy. And I ran through the whole fortress with Ashley to get six wither skulls to do wither mining. And here, I also found out there's actually a blaze farm which I did not know about. And in the whole time I've been here, I popped all of my totems, up except for this last one. But, and here I am getting out of the nether fortress because I am scared of it. I am just terrified of the nether fortress because, God, I popped so many totems already. Oh, that's what I'm talking about also. My luck is not that good. And that's why I would not survive hardcore even for one hour. If I did, I'd be surprised. That definitely was not a fun experience in the nether. I popped so many totems and I... <laughs> I had to score to settle with stupid wither skeletons. Oh lord, that was a pain. But at least it was a base farm, which I did not expect. But I... Yeah, I made a lot because I actually... They are slow. But also, it'll be worth it because honestly, I know I'm going to be needing to make a lot of light vision potions. Here I'm just taking out uh, protection for books out of my e chest and putting it on my armor so I can get ready for a wither mining session with the whole server. And we are getting prepared with all these potions and stuff. I made a bunch of potions right here, a bunch of night vision, a bunch of night vision here, and some strength and speed and more night vision here. And we have the wither. Oh, just why did I grab? I grabbed uh, three more by accident. Okay, uh, and made a like 11 stacks of torches, made a pot for running armor, and uh, let's hope we are. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, also, prepare for this. I have to empty this choker. Chokers. Uh, so let's go find an area to go fight the wither in and do the wither mining. So we are almost all ready for the wither mine because uh, we are still waiting on a, a couple more people like Sunny and uh, Coop. Oh, there's Coop. Oh, hey Coop. And um, uh, it's like an Avengers Assemble type thing. So like, uh, so yeah. So like we're gonna go somewhere over there to uh do the sound a little bit stressed because I'm like literally I did not do a wither fight or mining session on hard mode in a long time because the other server literally had easy mode and it was easy, but here it's actually scary. And also I have like three tones because I know I'm gonna die. And this was a fun uh wither mining and a little bit of uh um, people also like had to pop totems because they could, like me, getting withered away. This was a fun experience, but at least I got my wither star. The second one was supposed to be for Baron, but yeah. This was great. This was great. Oh, stupid spider. Ooh, boy, that was close. At least I have a beacon acquired. So the second one was supposed to be for Baron. As I said, don't know where it went. But I'm thinking of, in today's episode, clearing out this area here, like from the trees, the extending the road, and making an area like underground here somewhere for like a metro station. And there'll be another line. Baron has like one line like from old spawn to new spawn. But there's supposed to be another line going somewhere. I have no idea about that. But I'm thinking of having my own line connecting here, like maybe like three stations, like one is like from like new spawn or old spawn, whatever. And then like one goes somewhere else and then the second one goes somewhere else also. But yeah, that's the plan. So let's go to super fast grind mode, like for chopping down trees. Let's go. for the turn down on the trees. Uh, Baron helped me uh, clear out uh, the 100 by 100 area here because like 
uh, to figure out where I would have my uh, station build. Because like there will be one line going to there. Like, it'll be three lines. Like it'll be like a central hub. So like three lines. But yeah, and so line one is. Um, but I'm just trying to figure out where it would go. So let me get back. I'm done with this arch thing, but uh, this arch has to move more to the left here because of the tunnel. And this man. Uh, but then get uh, successful time runs because for some reason the game didn't capture. Don't know why. But um, then the tunnel was barren and most of the server to mine out this tunnel. And no, there goes so far. Like all the way to the Maestro station. And this connects all the way up M continent line one. And this is going to take so much rail, but it's going to be worth it because of how like long it is. And also it's going to be useful for other um, things like if you want to transport villagers or something, villagers or something. But, and also right here is a nice turn, like a nice, like, Quarter of a circle and going all the way to Mesha Station, which is right over here, which is actually not too bad if it's like all dug out. But this area is not fully dug out and finished, but there it is. But here it's still needs some work, and the other side also, just for the scening. And right here is Mesha Station, which we are here already. I don't know why there's a donkey, but <laughs> it like great. Is this a baby donkey or no? Like, oops, um, I meant to press shift. Is it? I don't know. Um, yeah, but right here it's done. Wait, why is there going up? Oh, I have no idea. But yeah. So right now let's transition from this to this. And right here we have the, like a reinforced copper with a rim of like making it stronger between each section with a polished blackstone and uh true knights to the nice steampunk light feel and there will also be end rods up there to make it a little bit modern but it'll be both modern and steampunk in one and it'll be real cool to have it for the rest and after showing the in rods, I done a little bit more work. I done a little bit more work on the floor. I done there's still the rail, and like done more work on this side for like a different gauge. It's like and uh done like uh, trying to figure out how to do an arch like type thing. And here's like there'll be like a couple cogs, but uh for today I think this is real good, and. I'm going to be going with Zerpo to an uh, ancient city to do who spawn a warden to bring to spawn. I have a grand surprise uh, name tag right here. Yeah. Uh, soul sand, water, rockets, and some nitra. And have to just get some uh, kelp and a bed. And also right here, downstairs, and right here is going to be a, a escalator. So let's get a warden. Let's get out of here, Barry. Hang on, kit. Drink that. Behind you on the floor. <laughs> oh, f get over here. <laughs> I'm best. I'm best. I'm best. Oh no. All of my stuff's gone. Okay. Do you guys like our? Do you guys like Go our friend? Go find him. Go find him, y'all. Here, take this. Take this. Nah, I, I mean, I'm not so cool. Nope. Friend, where are you? Hey, yeah, Ash, where I got, I got an important question for you later. I, I, I left a while ago. So you guys have fun with that. I'm gonna sit here invisible and just watch from a distance. Oh, I. <laughs> Is this? Is it downstairs in the bar? Oh yeah, it's in there, bro. It's in there, bro. Kate, Kate, why are you invisible? Guys, we don't hear. Guys, we don't hear. Oh, no, 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 no. 
guys, come lead us to the main I bar. See it. Where Kit is. Oh, it's in the stage room. Oh, it's giving what up the f. He's giving up what the f. that? Oh, man. F you. Wait, yeah, guys, you're just giving us a Gun. I know this is your idea. Um, Coops? It was, like, I not his eyes. I see his eyes. Boobs, I don't like him. I see, I see his eyes. Look at him. It was Steam's idea. Steam. Steam, I thought you were my friend, man. No, it wasn't my idea exactly. I, nah, he Zerpo... didn't... No. Alright, it was Zerpo's idea. Bro. No, Hi, fuck buddy. Fuck. Hi. Yeah, I'll get paid enough for this. Two man, hours. can you give me some of those fucking, like, invisibility potions? I see you walking. Uh, What's up, Astro? What's up, Astro? Uh, we have a it's container. Not there. There. It's not me down there, man. Oh, I'm sorry, Baron. Somebody killed Coop. He yeah, deserves you ought to be sorry. What's up, Yogs? <laughs> y'all, y'all spent two hours of dragging out here for me just to walk. This went so horribly wrong. This was not meant to happen. It was supposed to be a prank. Everyone get Let in. Let me out. Push Coop in there. Ash, what do you do? You guys don't understand how long it took to get it out of the deep dark. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> that lasted less than crazy. five minutes. So. We just had that whole incident with the warden, called it Baron's Surprise. And I wanted to have a surprise in there, but it didn't really work out, but it was funny. Took forever to get, but I went into then just to get one item. Oh, we're going to the end to get some coarse fruit and some end stone. Uh, so we can do more of the tunnel back at base, wherever it is. And, um... Yeah, so let's go. Now, oh, um, that felt a little bit underclimactic because it didn't. Oh, didn't oh, how many times have they gone in here? Wait, what's. And honestly, I'm doing this also because I also want to. That one is. I actually want to do this so, like, I uh, have an elytra actually up in. Holy moly, how many times have they gonna do this now? And wings acquired officially. Oh, that makes me happy. And I got some shulker shells. Uh, what's in here? Oh, that's a good pick. And got some gold. And ooh, gold in here. Diamonds. Diamonds. Uh, who needs a saddle? Oh, I got a chest plate. That's nice. No, I'm gonna even grab some of this because honestly, this, this is not easy in a way. So I'm gonna have to grab some of the obsidian because honestly, I don't need a portal. So have, this is gonna take a while. And we are back from the end city thing. And it's been like a good couple of days. Because I have a secret Santa I've been working on, and it's for Astro. And I know there was an incident and new spawn where, like, actually, there was like a restaurant, and then, like, Astro like, was owning it or something, and then he built underneath, and then someone destroyed it. And it made me a perfect gift for Astro that I loved to build and it's one of the best builds i have ever built and i'm just surprised on how good it is because i never built something this good and i have a secret entrance and one can lick it there right there a secret entrance for steampunk cafe oh yeah I love the radiance. I love the giant gear here, the little gear, the wall, the honey comb, the nice stairs, the the glazed terracotta that is like like this, the pistons that look like tables, a lot of the drinks like you have like your carrot juice, your night vision, your other drinks that you have a Nice speed boost. You have your giant area for the cooking, like a 64 in total smokers, like smoke the meat. I actually forgot I didn't finish this area, but it's gonna be finished. And this is so beautiful. 
have it all beautiful. All the laying is underneath the slabs because, like, if it's a full block, it won't go through it. And I love it. And I love the pillars that look so beautiful with the supports and this giant cool hallway coming into here. It looks so cool with the hallway. And I'm honestly in love with this. And your nice, like, Order of the Stone Garden or something. I don't know. I um, love it. And I love all the blocks, like, I've used, like, because, like, a lot of it I've used all in the metro and, like, in here. I've done more than this, but most of it. And it looks so good here. And I love the farm, like, garden. You have, like, the nether work for, like, the potions, the sugar cane, the carrots, the wheat beetroot, like having some borscht for like in the restaurant, cafe, and man, this is so beautiful. So happy to give this to Astro. <laughs> this looks amazing and I love it. <laughs> man, I hope you're so happy because honestly, this is so good. And also Ash can have the restaurant also because this is so good. Oh man, I never built something this good. So let's show Astro his new restaurant for Secret Santa. Oh yeah. Are you finished with all of this or are you still gonna add to it? I'm gonna add like a uh, like a steam locomotive or something, but I do not know the design okay. yet. But uh yeah. But for the station itself it's done. You just have to move out all the the chests. Uh, Ash, okay. pull like the it. lever. A lever. Welcome, Astro. To okay. Steam Yo. Punk. Yo. Welcome to Steampunk okay. Cafe. Cafe. Dude, how did you get? How did you do all this? Jesus. <laughs> it oh, took a couple days. Cool. Yeah, yeah, I can tell. Okay. Wait, this. Oh, look at all the look at all the cafe things. Give me a give me a tour around this place. Oh yeah. Every uh, every brewing stand has one blaze powder for power, for the fuel, and all of them have practically all of them have water bottles. And okay. here is the the kitchen, yeah, and yeah. six more than sixty four smokers to like cook. Mm. And uh, nice brick courts here, and all the pistons as like it's a really table. good. And a nice cut copper ceiling, and everything is lit. Yeah. The whole thing is it, lit with yeah. torches. Wow. It's very. Yeah. <laughs> this is sick. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> this took. This was the most expensive thing right here. Hey, what's this? Is this? Is this? Where is that? Honey? Honeycomb? Yeah, honeycomb. Where is that? Wait, wait. Oh, what's yeah. this? The steam. Oh yeah, that's the Order of the Stone Garden. <clears throat> wait, this was cool. back here. Garden. This is the garden. Oh, it's a garden. Yeah, the garden. With the nether wart, with the carrots, the nice. sugar cane, the beets, and the beets, and the beets for like the borscht, and uh, the wheat, and ore of the stone. Oh, oh because the sign block. Just... Yeah. Ashley broke it. No. Oh, yeah. Ashley. <laughs> yeah. And look at this design. All of this was designed by me. All of this. Every single cool. bit. This is a lot of copper, I can't lie. Yeah. Have you noticed a giant gear right here? Imagine if you could get stuff like that actually moving. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah, that'd be cool. That'd be really cool. I have a little gear here also. Oh yeah, an astro. Hey, you, can flip the, you can flip the lever from here oh. to close the door cool. and open it. It's really fast. That's cool. That is cool. I've seen something like that on a different video, and like, yeah, that's, really, that's nice. Wait, can I get crushed by it? Uh, no, Probably. you cannot. But you only get pushed out. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> but uh, you can give it to him. I sh give it to him. What to me? What is this? This is for you, Astro. Um. This. Well, okay. Steampunk Cafe is for you. Okay. 
You own this. You're the owner. Of this whole place? Yes. This whole restaurant You're right here. Me, no. This is for Bro. you. Oh. This is all for you. Dude. So this Since... whole this whole thing right here is mine. Yes. It is. Dude, that's sick. You are like helping Dude. for Baron and you are like uh-huh. Like your assistant. And you wow. your place got destroyed or like <laughs> Ashley Nick built. I felt yeah. bad. And I, I built this for yeah. you. The garden's for you. Dude. The cafe is yours. You have the drinks. You can make uh-huh. all of your brewing stuff, cook everything. Yeah. This is yours. You own this. Bro, this is all for thank you. you, man. This is nice. Yeah. Took a couple Fucking, days, but it's wow. so... Yeah. yeah, I could tell. This whole thing. I had to mine out everything in here. Mm-hmm. No, I like the like, I like the variety of like blocks here. Yeah, it's like really like aesthetically pleasing to look at, you know. Yeah, yeah. especially like, this floor right here. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, the glazed terracotta. Dude, thank you. You're wow. welcome. Yeah. Wow. This whole thing is this is really cool. And I'm happy that Astro is happy with his gift, and we are ending episode two on Astro's gift. And we're going to figure out what we're going to do next episode. And I think we're going to start doing a bit of the station on top, like to make it more complete and maybe something else. Maybe some shenanigans. I have no idea. We'll see on episode two. And I also got this netherite armor from a person called Tyler. Like I'm Tyler or something. I forget his full name, but the thing is, he gave this as a gift, as a present, I think for a secret center, but man, this is so cool. And also, I had another set of armor, but uh, it disintegrated. I don't know how. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next episode. And please consider subscribing. Goodbye.